Congratulations. Every week you just keep getting better and better. And better. Tonight was phenomenal. Um, which of these three songs was the hardest for you or the most challenging? Um, Demons was probably the hardest because I mean I was I was sta I was standing on a slanted stage of like LED lights that were that dangerous. It was because every time I started really getting into the song, I'd like wobble and be like, wait, oh yeah, I have to I have to remember not to fall on my face because it was a, it was a pretty long fall at that point. So um, yeah, that was a constant struggle with trying to get into the song and trying to stay on my feet. You did it well. You did it well. Thank you. Um, and you sang Hallelujah. America chose that for you. You even teased us with it last week at Jingle Wall, or this week, past weekend. Um, was that nerve-wracking to have to sing a song you've already sung, or were you excited to get to do it again? I was so excited to be able to do it again and, and honored that America chose that song because it was like everything got to come full circle for me. You know, I've been trying to live up to that audition ever since I auditioned. And so... Um, it was really great to just have a chance to do it again and it kind of gave me that redemption feeling and have all the judges stand up afterwards is, you know, I mean, it was a, it was a very emotional song for me and, and it took me a long time to get out of that, that headspace of emotion that I was in, but um, I'm just, I was just honored that I got to do it. And what went into prepping for this week, like working with Kelly and obviously learning the staging of those songs? Yeah, lots and lots and lots, tons of interviews. Um, wardrobe which we had so many different outfits you know and um, just I mean the list goes on and on and on and on and on forever and going into the finals so when you make it to the finals what can we expect from your performance uh, my performance I've, I've been letting go more and more and more during this competition it's something that Kelly's really helped me with because I used to I used to have walls around me and I used to hide behind them you know even though I was on stage and and She's really helped me throughout the process of this show to, to let go more, and, and that's a feeling I can't even explain in words. So. Is there a song that you're dying to sing on the show? Uh, well, Hallelujah would have been it, so uh, I'm, I'm, just, I'm excited to find out what she's chosen for me this upcoming week, uh, if I should make it, and uh, hopefully America votes so I can get that opportunity. The other big thing with the finale is that you get to perform with a known singer, so who would be your dream to perform with? Oh, man. So many. I mean, Billy Joel. I mean, go big. Bruce Springsteen, you know? Right. Yeah. I suggested Bon Jovi, I think. Yeah, Bon Jovi would be awesome. Richie or John. Um, man, Train, Goo Goo Dolls. Uh, who knows? Uh, Brian Adams. And when you get to make your own record, what kind of music would we expect from Jeff Goot? Real music. It's going to be real. It's going to be, you know... Um, it's gonna be—it's gonna be something that comes from deep within my soul. It won't be there. Won't, there won't be any smoke and mirrors when it comes to my record. And if you could go back in time and give the self of you that like auditioned some advice, what advice would you give him? Just stick with it. Just stick with it. You know, um, you get a lot of no's in this industry, but it only takes one yes. So um, I would just say stick with it. Uh, it's hard. It's hard to get to go through the roller coaster of the music industry at times, but. Um, you, you find out a lot about yourself as, with your failures and your successes, you know. Um, you can you, you learn a lot about yourself and who you are. And do you have a New Year's resolution for this year? New Year's resolution is to uh, get a lot more rest. It's been, uh, this week has been really hard because we, uh, you know, we've had a, we had to do the duet and we had to do the stuff that we're getting ready to do tomorrow and it was a, it was a lot of work to cram into one week. So um, I'm excited to get back to the hotel and have a glass of wine and chillax. Awesome. And last thing, we're going to do some X Factor word association. So the first thing that pops in your head when you hear these names, Demi Lovato. Pretty. Carlito. Badass. Alex and Sierra. Sweet. Restless Road. Tough. Simon Cowell. Smart. Okay. Kelly Rowland. Beautiful. Paulina Rubio. Spanish. And last one, the X Factor. Me. And what would you tell America, what would you tell them to have them vote for you and why you need to be in the finals? Um, hopefully America already knows why they should vote for me and why I should be in the finals. Because um, if they don't know that, then I don't have the X Factor.